our Alice is bored, she's disappointed, she's frustrated, she's not being listened to, nothing is right, the, the lights on the tree don't work, her little brother is teasing her, no one is paying attention to her, and she just wants to escape and find this perfect holiday adventure that she just so perfectly imagines. And on this journey through Winter Wonderland, she discovers, well, I don't want to spoil too much, it's a lot of fun. It's crazy. There are we have pu we have shadow puppets. We have we have light up gloves. We have uh, umbrellas with twinkly lights on them to you know give us the give us the feeling of snow. We have a we have like puppets. We have a puppet for Dinah the cat who I come on stage carrying. And so there's so many crazy elements. It's not just the it's not just our fellow cast members we are working with. I connect with Alice a lot in the way of just, you know, remembering what it was like as a 12, 13 year old around the holidays, realizing that the holidays aren't necessarily all whimsy and wonder and, you know, everything packaged up in a little box and presented to you on Christmas morning. It's And in that way, I think that there's something in this production for everyone. Something for the kids, something for the adults, especially for the adults. As an adult myself, playing a 12, 13 year old girl, um, just really getting connect, getting to connect with my inner child a bit and sort of rediscover what it means to enjoy a holiday. Come see Alice in Winter Wonderland to be taken on an adventure of whimsy and hope and wonder.